This is a short movie showing Image Pro Premiere version 9 and how to use the Features Manager. Features Manager is capable of saving different types of overlays such as regions of interest, annotations, measurements, line profiles, and grids. Right now I'm going to show a short example by selecting an image and going to the Select tab. The Select tab allows me to draw regions of interest and annotations. In this case, I'm going to make sure I have multiple regions turned on which is this little icon here, and you can see that's highlighted in yellow. And I'm going to draw a region of interest. I can select a region of interest and draw that on the image. To make it a little bit easier to visualize, I'm actually going to select that, highlight the annotations options, so I can now change the thickness a little bit so it's a little bit easier to see. I'm just going to save this as my default. I'm going to draw a few more regions, and the purpose of this is just to show that I can easily create multiple regions of interest. And now I want to save these and reuse these later on. To do that, I'm going to use the Features Manager, which is this icon here. This will bring up the Features Manager. From here, I can choose to save these regions as a set. So I'm just going to simply add all. And you'll notice two things. One is, based upon the name of the image, it's created a set of regions of interest. This simply saves all the regions of interest. I can also rename the set, simply just selecting and renaming it. I can save these for later use. What I can also do is by selecting another image, I can recall individual regions onto the image. I'm just going to simply under regions delete that one or I can recall all of the regions. So this is a very powerful tool for managing all of your overlays. Again, whether they're regions of interest, grids, um, line profile measurements, or, or objects from measurements. Right now I'm going to delete all these from the image. And there's also a very powerful tool included within Features Manager that I can change the overlays from one form to another. Right now, they're regions of interest, but when I load them back to another image, for example, I can change them to measurements. You'll see that the icons have changed. And now when I load them back, these are now measurements. So that I can actually use these to generate image information from. You can see by hovering over the object, it actually is reporting out how large it is. And if I have other types of measurements set up, it will report out that information. So if there's intensity information or average Pixel intensity, I can act average object intensity, I can bring that information up. So this is a very powerful tool. And later in a separate movie, using the grids tool, I will show you how to take grids, save those as regions of interest, and overlay those back onto another image so that I can actually count within each of those regions. For more information, please contact your local dealer or local sales office for more information. Thank you.